Camera Dish with D. That's me. How you doing, folks? You know, there's a lot going on out in the world, and I just wanted to check in with our with our stress eaters, because with all this Corona thing going on, there's a lot of people upset, rightly so. And those there's definitely people that stress eat. I am not a stress eater. I'm a stress cleaner. <laughs> I know. But I know people, that's how they cope. And sometimes as much as we tell ourselves, that's not, you know, it's just how we cope. And with the way things are going, I kind of get it. And you're, I'm, you're never going to hear from me that, oh my God, you should do something else. Because I get it. I, I'm a stress Netflix watcher. So when I get really stressed out, I go on and I binge something. So I highly recommend that. <laughs> and I highly recommend... Again, remember, this is my channel, my opinion. You guys can take what I say or you don't have to. I'm a big opponent of vitamin C. Flu, cold and flu season, I double up my vitamin C. I take a 500 every day supplement. But when it's when times are like this, when it's like, you know, I go up to 1,000 milligrams a day, it boosts my immune system. And you know what? It, I feel it, that's, you know, that's my thing you know wash your hands you know there's so much stuff out there um but we should be doing this stuff anyway but i get and, and with the news it's like all negative and there are people that are surviving this and getting better and we don't ever hear about that much but you know the best thing we can do is wash our hands stay out of crowded areas watch dish with d i am going to i think next week we might be closing school i'm not sure i haven't heard anything yet but i've decided even if i'm that's cool. I am gonna. I think I'm gonna do a live every day for you guys because I'm not sure who could get to a meeting and who can't. So I thought it might be a good idea to just to do a live every day. If you guys need an outlet, if you need some reinforcement, if you just need to talk, distraction is always good. So I thought, you know what? We're gonna do a live every day. I'm not sure when I'm gonna start it. Whether it just be Sunday or it might be different times. I'm not really quite sure I should be something regular this way you guys can know but I'm thinking maybe I'll try to do a live tonight I'm just trying to see what I have planned for the night with the kids being around and stuff but yeah I want to be there for you guys because like I said I know there are stress eaters out there and I'm not going to sit here and be the first one to tell you oh you know just to find something else to do it's not that easy that's how you cope that's how you cope is it right is it wrong I'm not going to say it's right or wrong try to maybe to find things like low point stuff to snack on popcorn you know hummus and dip um some crunchy vegetables i love to crunch on celery i know it sounds so weird that sounds so diety i know but all of a sudden celery's been my jam at my homemade ranch and sugar snap peas and cucumbers and radishes and homemade my homemade hummus is zero points i hopefully will remember to link the card in for that it's zero points and it's not going to kill you in points you know but I get it. I get that we're stressing about this. And we should because you know what? It's something we have no idea about. And they really don't know. But the bottom line is it's a virus. And, you know, you just have to stay away from crowds. Keep clean. And if you don't feel well, call your doctor. That is the best message that I could offer. Because that is the, the only thing we really can do. And be there for each other, you know? It, it's, it's just a hard time because we just don't know. But... There's just so much to say. Um, I know somebody was had posted something, and it makes a little bit of sense, but, you know, some people, you know, they say there's, like, this test you can take where if you inhale and hold your breath for 10 seconds and you don't cough, that's a test for your lungs because if there's an infection in there, which is a sure sign that you should at least be checked by your doctor, that you, you, you can get through 10 seconds holding your breath and not coughing, your lungs really are in good, better shape. I mean, it's also saying that you should drink plenty of water. We always should drink plenty of water because it keeps our system flushed. And if these bacteria and viruses are like living in our in a respiratory tract, flushing them out, flushing them into our system might help it out a little bit. So that's always a good additive in any situation and any kind, even the common cold, you know, to just be proactive. I, of course, don't recommend watching the news as much because I think the news is just a little bit of an overkill. I get we have to be, you know, cautious and I understand that, but it's we we need you know tell us spend a few minutes and let's just move on because i just feel like we're 
or just eat, sleeping, and drinking this. And it's just, it's, and there's some people that can't handle this much stress. It upsets them. And then they turn to food. So I am definitely trying to be there for you guys as a way to de stress, just talk about what's going on, talk about our food issues, maybe make a little fun out of it because it's a tough time. And if we're, if we're staying in a lot, we need, we're missing, you know, with being with our friends and stuff and being in our meeting. So I'm trying to bring that to you guys on a regular basis because I get it. I above all get it. So Dish with D is putting her PSA out. That wash your hands, drink your water, know where your bathrooms are. That's just Jeff Patty White always says. And, you know, just try to relax. You know, there's, I mean, why people are buying toilet paper, I'm really not quite sure. But that apparently is a big thing. So, I mean, and, and try not to buy too much stuff because there's people that don't get anything because all the shelves are wiped clean by the time they get out of work and go shopping, there's nothing out there. So, let's hope they can get some supplies. I did get my corned beef for my corned beef and cabbage for St. Patty's Day. So, that'll be a must in a dish with the house. We always have corned beef and cabbage. Though I didn't get any cabbage, the cabbage was all wiped out. So, I might be making corned beef specials, which that will make them just as happy. But yeah, so if you have, you know, if you're stressing, you know, I'm going to be putting more tea with these out there because I think that's what we need something to focus on. Something just to get away from it just for a little bit. Because guess what? It's still going to be there when we're done. I wish to sure that it'll still be there when we're done. And I, I'm a Netflix binger. So I really should, I'm thinking about putting a list together of my favorite Netflix binges. In case you're bored and want to watch something. There's a really, a, several that I've binged watched that are really good and the one I just finished was Lock and Key that was pretty good it was I like a suspense a mystery a little bit of you know scariness and it's not actually I was hoping it would be more scary but it definitely gave you some thought and I liked my mind and like I said and I, I sit there and I watch it on my computer it takes me away for a little bit but guess what life's still there when you get done so it's not going to go anywhere just you need to get away from it a little bit but that's my PSA for today. I thank you for listening. If you haven't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. I'd appreciate it. And hit that notification bell. Let's you know when Dishwiti uploads. I upload da daily inspirational and support vlogs. Uh, tomorrow's weigh-in. I'm not sure whether I'm going. As far as I know, it's still open. So I will go to weigh-in tomorrow. Because I'm not really sure about next week. So I will go. Again, I don't even have to go. But it keeps me... Um, Honest, I go and I support my friends, Linda, and the rest of the Saturday morning crew. So, yeah, I will definitely be going, and I will give you the, I think, the topic. I did hear what it was. It wasn't anything that I'm a fan of. Be nice to yourself. I'm always nice to myself. I'm nice to you guys, too. But, yes, hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed this. If you know anybody that Dish With D needs, you know, please share my channel. Share the tea with D. If, invite people to come. Share the link. Everybody's welcome. No matter what plan you're on. Even if you do keto, you can come, too. I don't care. You know, we're all in this together. Let's keep it that way. Have a great and fantastic rest of your day, and we will vlog tomorrow.